funny thing is, is we wrote this book, and I'm much more puzzled about marriage after writing the book than How I so? was even before. What, in what way? Well, because I, I think that it really is a, an obsolete institution. It doesn't make sense anymore for many reasons. First of all, we're well, we living too that. long. The institution of marriage was never meant to be for so fucking long. No, too People long. would die in there. You, a woman gives birth a couple times, she's she's out. She's, she's dead. dead. She's you dead. Know? You get a new one. You, right. You know, yeah. A guy gets a cold in his 40s. Is like, oh wow, he lived a long time. I mean, yeah. no one ever anticipated we'd be living this long. So the idea that marriages would we, we, last 40s, this long, 40 it's was ridiculous. the old days. Yeah, yeah. You know, so first of all, so it's it's a it's a di- we're dinosaurs, really. But the problem but what's the is, other what's the alternative? What are you going to well, be polyamorous? That's now, the do thing. you want to start introducing new people into the relationship? Could you handle that? I don't think I could handle that. Right. That's no, the problem that, that's is, is that either. our psychology, our brains have not evolved uh, to adapt to our longer lifespans in a way that would really make sense, which would be yeah, like. But we instance, also get married. When too. when Alvin Toffler wrote, you know, the, the third, third wave, wave, yeah, the whole I supposition and future shock. What the whole supposition was there be serial marriages. You at different times in your life would have marriages that were appropriate to these different. Plenty changes of people do that. That right happens now. all the time. Yeah. It's called the midwife crisis, and right, then someone have, dies. Yeah. There's three marriages. Right. Yeah. That, you know. Oh, we should be lucky enough that someone should he, die. Who's that? Right. Who's, he, who's if, Toffler uh, married to right now? His same wife, okay. though. See, that's the crazy thing. Is the difference between you there's know, people googling Toffler right now. Ideas and actually in practice life because the truth is is that first of all if you're seriously rich you can do whatever you want yeah you don't I mean yeah. when people you talk can buy about, people uh, and yeah. pretend like they love you ex- <laughs> uh, yes and then you then you fire them like Ron Perlman he's got like he's Ron Ron, Ron, Perlman. Ron not Perlman Ron Perlman yeah. very big difference yeah. Hellboy versus the chairman of Estee right. Lauder right? Yeah. right so he goes from marriage to marriage and Ellen Barkin gets a lot of uh, for a nice jewelry she gets a lot of cash out yeah. of it right then you're done moves on to the next but if you're not super rich you can't afford to do that and then there's the human aspect of that we get attached attachments to each other some of them are healthy attachments some of them are unhealthy why do we stay together maybe it's our neurosis and our 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 codependence or maybe we actually it's that human thing that being human is lonely and you worry about you know right so you're saying and so you right so you settle i get it so but she uh, just thinks she she's she's a very theoretical person she's all about like thinking and figuring it out well i think the only issue that i (laughs) yeah so it's so How's that going? Not so great. <laughs> what are you saying? Not so great. But statistically speaking, married people still have more sex than single people. Of course, because okay? you're in the same room. Yeah, and when you're, when you know, we do so much in a small town. It's like yeah. when you're married, you forget how hard it is to get laid. I mean, no, you I, have to I, go I, through a lot of work. You yeah. have to take people out. You have to meet them. You have to. Not if you're rich, you're famous. Not right. if you're rich, you're famous. Of it's course, am- it's, it's a very different what world. what rich and fame can do to. To panties. But let's, uh, oh yeah, yeah. but uh, but panties let's, off. Lock the gate. <laughs>